Good morning. It is the first day of classes of the new semester and I'm already overslept a tiny bit and almost late, okay. The outfit for the day, we've got earrings, jewelry, and this little outfit going on. I do not have time to do my makeup or whatever. That is what I get for waking up late. But I do have technically breakfast because I'll try to meal prep my breakfast knowing I would be late. <laughs> Man, this is what I get for not fixing my sleep schedule like before school starts. Cheesy pudding. Oh. Okay, as I wait for a ride, let me tell you a bit about myself. My name is Joan, or known as Sojo on this channel. I am a second year integrated sciences student at UBC, so University of British Columbia on the Vancouver campus. This is the first day of second semester. It's currently around 7.30 a.m. I actually don't have class until 10 a.m., but I do have a work shift this morning. I don't know if you can tell, but I am not a early riser. Everyone say hi to my ride. <laughs> Thanks, Norman. Are you excited for the first day of school? I am, yes. Very excited. Well, I'm not, so. <laughs> <laughs> So I just made it back home, probably for the rest of the day. I'm just gonna get some like tasks done in regards to the courses. Since this week is technically syllabus week, which basically means like the first few classes, we're not really learning any like lecture content. It's mostly just going over the syllabus, what's going on in the course. So there's not like crazy amounts of like homework or readings yet, but there probably is going to be near the end of the week. I'm probably just gonna finish up prepping and planning for my courses, organizing stuff like my to-do list, Google Calendar, Notion, also clearing out my good notes, figuring out how I'm gonna take notes for classes, also getting the textbook, since you should not get the textbook right away, you should definitely wait until perhaps like a few of your classes to figure out if you actually do need your textbook or not. Also, you can probably get some textbooks for free, so it's also good to check those out as well as kind of a hack for uni. Overall, for a first day, this wasn't too bad, but in general, I feel like the classes I'm in, they seem okay so far. It's just basically this term, when once I'm over, I'll be done second year. That's honestly really scary to think about, not gonna lie. I'll make some dinner, probably do a bit of editing, and yeah, that's kind of the rest of my day. I just finished dinner and I almost forgot that I had a meeting, but I'm in it right now. And I think I'm just gonna work on just organizing some course stuff and make it start on some pre readings, and that'll be it for the work today. Doing a bit better this morning. Got some guava for breakfast. I can do some quick makeup, then head out for the day. I've got two classes today, although 
I'm planning on sitting into a class I'm actually not in right now because I am on the wait list for it. And I want to see if I would like it and also to not miss that just in case I do get into the class. Um, but my friends are in that class, so it's fine. I'll just be sitting in with them. And then I actually do have to stay on campus a little later because I do have a meeting. I'm also planning on working out as well since I did get my gym membership. Today will be a longer day on campus. Less classes, but longer day. And this is the outfit for the day. just gonna work on some readings for the rest of the night. I already got readings piling up for classes and also schedule out everything else I have for the rest of the week. And I still have a lot of stuff. I'm pretty tired, I'm gonna be honest, but I'm gonna try to get a decent amount of sleep so I can still power through for the rest of the week. Mm -hmm. I swear, man, I actually just suck. Oh, I can't afford it. It's day three. Wednesday, technically halfway through the week. We're going with a cozier outfit today. Just some sweatpants, classic black long sleeve, because I'm feeling lazy today. registered in class but we'll still go to the class trend. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Alright, we've got two more classes back to back and then work and that'll be my time on campus.
very cold. Just made it back home. I think I'm gonna take a quick shower and then continue working on school stuff. <laughs> Honestly, so far I'm really liking the classes. They don't seem like crazy too hard, but I feel like I'm already behind, but I'm not really, I just feel like stressed. I think I'm stressed not necessarily because I have so much to do in terms of like homework and stuff, but I feel like it's just the fact that I haven't yet figured out how I want to exactly take notes for my classes and how I want to like study for them. Because so I think especially having like two psychology courses, I'm just trying to get used to the whole like readings thing, having a lot to read and not really taking the same style of notes as I usually do for like science courses. I think I'm slowly figuring it out. We only have two more days left of first week. Good morning to me, I guess. Outfit of the day. It's time for the segment of Joan tries to do her makeup in the car. It's time to get bubble tea! Bubble tea! Yay! For a discount even better! <laughs> Why is it kind of far? It's so windy and rainy and disgusting. Into the dungeon we go. <laughs> the hidden gem of eats. And there's our target inside. <laughs> walked around for like how, how long was that? 15 minutes at least 15 minutes just trying to find a spot to sit and eat lunch like I, I'm assuming it's because of the rain day but like it is crazy crazy like just look behind me already <laughs> what? Time to change. I'm walking around in bare shorts and it's freezing cold and wet and windy. Help me! <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I also wanted to take a quick moment and talk about like what I mean by like preparing and prepping for classes and also kind of the main reason why I've been stressed, even though it's still this week and there's not supposed to be like work, homework and new stuff, you know? Basically, I try to keep myself organized. I would consider myself an organized person, not necessarily by like preference, almost like by habit and by necessity at this point. Like I forget things if I don't write them down on my to-do list. 
my like self-discipline motivation all comes from how I plan out my classes and organize everything. I'm still trying to learn how to learn and study for the classes I'm taking right now. A lot of times for new classes, depending on the professor, depending on the structure of the lessons and also the content that's being taught, all influences how I like to study and learn all the content. I try to develop a system for each class that I'm taking. Some things I look at are the pre-readings. Are there reading assignments I have to do every week? Is it before every lecture? Is it just for the week? How much readings do they usually give? Do I want to take notes while I'm doing the textbook readings? Are there weekly quizzes or homeworks? How do I study for those? Are they based on the pre-readings? Are they based on stuff we learn in lecture? And during lecture, how do I take notes? Do I annotate slides or PowerPoints? Do I write my notes? Do I type my notes? All of these things come into mind when I'm planning out my systems for my classes. In the long run, it just has helped me organize my thoughts and be a lot more efficient when I'm studying for classes. It's almost like an extra challenge. That's like, not only am I challenged to learn all the stuff that's being taught in class, but right now my challenge is learning how to learn. I don't know, it's like a whole complicated thing. Maybe it's just me who does this, but that's why syllabus week is still a really stressful week for me. I feel like I'm already over school and it's barely started. So I'm really ready for the weekend. We've got one day left, so let's push through it. I am tired as always. I'm less tired than the other days because my first class starts at 10. Last day of first week of classes for second term. Yay! We got basic outfit on. I'm just, I'm too tired to try anymore. We've got classes, we've got work. I'll be on campus pretty late, but it's okay. It's the last day, last push into the weekend. So let's go. Our psych class today is an online module. Technically, we could do it over the weekend, but we're gonna do it now because yes. we are good students on top of our stuff. Yes. <laughs> what the heck? What is Nicolas Cage doing to those poor people? Basically, the rest of my day is just gonna be work until like 7 p.m. But thankfully, work is fun. So honestly, I'm chilling. I have a meeting with my family commander from 4 to 4:30. <laughs> yeah. Hi. Is that? Yeah. I'm the word is. Okay, nice. <laughs> Popcorn! Thanks, Joaquin. Okay. <laughs> oh! Oh wait, that's so smart! Oh wait. <laughs> Delicious! Yay! We got posters to put up. This yummy black tea. Okay, getting ready for the weekend. I've planned out reading slash homework stuff, planned it out on the to-do list, getting ready for that. I feel like a normal routine of mine on Fridays is to plan out for the whole weekend. Whether that's work I need to do, homework I need to get done, quizzes to get done, all that jazz. So yeah, I think I'm gonna get a head start and some of the readings and everything. Probably watch the finale of Singles Inferno because I didn't realize it was out and probably catch up on sleep. I got this uh, glass jar thing that I really want to make matcha in, but it's like almost 11 p.m. so I don't think I should do that. But I get random food cribbing that night, not gonna lie, so that is mine for today, I guess. All right, then. I just want to thank you guys for joining me for this week. It has been quite a journey, and hopefully it kind of gives you guys an idea of what syllabus week is like.
like, but also just like life as a university student going to UBC. Let me know what other videos you guys want to see or if you have any questions about university for me down in the comments below and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!